Feature game, a rematch of the Olympic final, Sweden versus USA. We are deadlocked at two. Sweden with last rock. Line fine, line fine. Here in the fourth end. Take a look. Nice crowd here on a Friday morning. Fans rolling in for the weekend in the playoffs. Christopher Sundgren, 93% for the tournament. Corner guard this time in the even ends for Team Sweden. John Landsteiner, 91% for the week. Um, oh, I will answer. Nice pair, bud. The importance on their shots yeah, nowadays. Star judge, yeah, you're right. <laughs> There's been seven five scored this week. Wow. So the teams are scoring in bunches this week. And yeah. a six. Wow. <laughs> so, you know, the it's new like five rock rule is uh, certainly. Matt Hamilton. 89%. No, it was a little unsteady coming out of the hack. Solid hack. Let me take yeah. that. That's your shoulder, sir. Parker! Hard on our wow. Yep, you need to be physically fit, fit mentally fit. Like my last one. Yeah, stone I over curls, curls. rugs on the center. Sorry, John. I had Sorry. my board later. I threw pretty hard that we had to pound glass. I was pretty sure it was going to go nuts. All right. Not terrible. Wow. What a nice one. That's a miss from Hamilton. Let's see if Sweden can take advantage. Oh, yeah. I actually got quite a fortunate roll in behind the corner guard. The one that he caught. Sweden got to come around the high side. But it's not easy to draw around the centre past that yellow guard now. Rasmus Rana being asked to go around the pile out to the wing. Rasmus is, I think, really settled into his role on this team. He's the newest of the foursome in terms of the combination. I thought in his first season he was a little volatile as a player, but now he's got a much calmer demeanor out there on the ice. And this is a terrific shot here from Rana. Let's have a look in at Canada, Switzerland. Well, it's going to be a tough day for Team Switzerland, Rana. Yep, the woes continue. Huh? Canada do lie shot. Not easy for Switzerland to remove it. It would just wow. jam on <laughs> their own. Pretty close to half. In buffet. Great <laughs> double take out by <laughs> Matt <laughs> Hamilton. Certainly was. Sweden going to come down this path again that Rana threw down on the previous stone. This time it's Oscar Eriksson, left handed player. Get a good look at his release. The light goes green. That means a legal throw. I've seen a couple of hog line violations this week. And Rasmus Rana being one of them. And they get this stone into the rings. It looks a little short. Oh, great brushing by Team Sweden to wrap that one around. Unfortunately, the yellow's very close to it. USA switching sweepers. Be Matt Hamilton on the inside. To try and hold the line. Close. Yep. Yes. Hard. Low. Just Low. Hard. Chance Low. for USA to lie to here. Keep the shooter. Nice shot yep. here from Chris Plyce. Really nice shot. Now Sweden do not right. want to be forced to their one. Wow, that shot of mine was so how can they generate thought, a two like now? That's like a hit like a third. Yeah, it Oscar I, Erickson asking for a technical timeout. We've got some problems time. with some equipment by the looks of it. Uh, I'm, I'm third. I actually then accidentally play played one too early. Okay. Ah, has Sweden much. played a stone out of rotation? Okay. Yeah, the second player only play one yeah. shot. I don't know the rule. Our third. Ericsson threw Rana's stone. Then I guess Rasmus plays this one. Okay. Or yeah. Then I guess Rasmus plays Oscar. Bradley comes with Velasista. So in this situation, because. Yeah. Yeah. I would have never even noticed. Okay. <laughs> Didn't even cool. notice. Yeah. Yeah. Skip yeah. Yeah. yeah, he'll probably have to throw the last one <laughs> exactly of the Exactly right. Exactly. <laughs> 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 We're making it up on the spot here. Let's play the sixth. 
You oh. heard the UFC saying, we don't even know the rules. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, you should know the rules. You're playing at a world championship. The rules say, you play at a rotation, the player, if it's noticed, and it has been noticed, the person who missed their turn inadvertently has to throw the last rock of the end. Yeah, so Nicholas always planning ahead what he's going to be left with. It's now what Rasmus going to be left with. Rasmus will be throwing the last rock. But it's interesting how Oscar and Rasmus, neither of them noticed. Yeah. Neither did we, to be fair. So here is Oscar Eriksson. Makes the run back, nearly makes the run back double. It just goes across the top. I guess so. I think so this will be the, something the American guys can taunt the Swedes with for the rest of the game. Like eight foot. Show on this side, maybe. Playing rocks out of rotation is not something you see very often at this level. Can happen though. It obviously did. Yeah, but you're just so focused on the game and the shot, and you know if Oscar's moved to the hack. Five, six. Yeah. I would have thought it Seven, would have been more Rasmus saying, hey, wait, wait I've only thrown That's one. That's my rock. <laughs> it's over Get out of the hat. Right Especially when they're very, you know, the, they've like done their going. stone matching and the, exactly. the numbers exactly. that they're playing. Exactly. It's not always, you know, in chronological six. order uh, that they play the no, stones. Yeah. Exactly. Player A might throw rocks labeled two and seven. So I dropped and, the anchor a little bit. U.S. lies two. That one pops Last out the inside. It's a steep Last angle if they are thinking double Last takeout. Right <laughs> Nicholas Adin is going to be playing a little bit of third stone this end. He's got two to come, and then it'll be Rasmus Rana. So this would ordinarily be Oscar's rock, but now Nick is throwing it. So Nicholas Adin making a slightly premature move down to the delivery end. This is Sweden's fifth rock or sixth rock of the end. Ordinarily Oscar would be throwing this one. Sari! 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 Yep! Yep! Whoa! 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 Does that put him as like 100 percent playing at the third playing position the third for the position, week? So top the, the, top the table. And skips and thirds. Exactly. <laughs> There's Rasmus and Chris. Rasmus saying, "Ah, oh, well, yeah." Just do what we were doing. I'm ready to throw yeah, it. I'm, I'm Chris put me in, like coach. Seen Oscar throw that shot. I know Rasmus is so panicking it. that yeah. <laughs> the pressure of making that last stone. Oh, that seems like so much ice. I think it's good though. John Schuster throwing the skips rocks. The Americans have managed to count the stones properly. Yep. Solid hack. 85% for the week for John. Whoa. Clean. Whoa. 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 Solid. Whoa. Clean. Lance. Go ahead. Go ahead. Not going to get to nose. Skip, it's going to spill skip, and skip, set up skip, a potential skip. double takeout. It's good. Just rolled far enough that. I'm not sure that Sweden can make the double and leave it on the rings. It'll be close. Yeah, it's solid. It's a deal with me this morning. But it seems Well, looking at it from this angle, it does look like Adin can hit it fractionally off nose, make the double and maybe roll it on. Certainly leave it in a splittable place. It would be hard for the Americans to ignore. 
Matt We're Hamilton. <laughs> Sliders out having fun with the crowd, but of course Matt Hamilton uh, joining in. Yeah, Matt always embraces the fun, embraces the crowd. So even though this is Nick's second stone of the end, it is not the final shot of the end. Because the Swedes threw out a rotation, Erasmus will have to throw the last one. 86% for the week for Nick. Perfect as a third as far as we know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yes, 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 yes. 